Phillies are trackside for race number five, another division of the Isoba Stake. And here are the two-year-old pacers. One is Colada Fluke, on by Irvin Jeffrey Miller, by James Schrantz of Springfield, trained by Irvin Miller. Andy Miller gets the call. Two is Obvious Secret, on by Hunt Harness Horses, Inc., Big Rock, Illinois. Tom Simmons, the trainer driver. Three Stormy Classic, on by Fred and Judy Scott of Moorhaven, Florida. Fred Kelsey Scott, the trainer with Bill Alanya in the bike. Four Society's Delight, a scratch. Five Roam the Country, on by Scott Rigg, Philadelphia, Missouri. Bob Walker trains, Dean McGee drives. Six Cullen all the way, owned by Roberta Edwards of Carrollton. Sean Walker trains, and Tom Walker is up. Seven Fox Valley Allegra, owned by Fox Valley Standard Breds of Sherman. Tony Alanya, the trainer with Dale Heitman. And number eight, Juju Bean, owned by Sport and Life Racing Stable of Maywood. Jim Eaton trains, Dan Knox behind Juju Bean. Here they come. They're off and pacing. Stormy Classic looking for win number 12. Out quickly between Phillies on the outside of her. Fox Valley Allegra will get away second. Third is Obvious Secret on the inside. Racing for Color to Fluke as that field drives toward the turn. Headed toward the quarter. Getting out next is Cullen all the way. On the outside six is Juju Bean. And as they swing around the turn racing now toward the quarter mile mark. Trailing the field is Rome the country. Change up front to the lead now. Fox Valley Allegra and Heitman make the top at the quarter. They'll lead him now down the back stretch. Picking up Second is Stormy Classic, racing third on the inside, Obvious Secret. Fourth against the rail is Cullen to Fluke, racing five, Cullen all the way. Six now past the quarter, Juju Bean at the back, roam the country. Front panel 27-1, rolling as they reach the back stretch. Quick quarter, 27-1, they head toward the half. And racing with the lead by a length and a half down the backside as the pace now is slowed. Is Fox Valley Allegra to the outside, to the front now. As they race to the half is Stormy Classic, following her, ranging up from way, way back as they reach that mark and race past it is Juju Bean. Field driving past the draw gate. Strong test by Juju Bean on the outside and Knox has moved her from 7th to be 2nd by just half a length as they race past the half in 58-2 a leisurely 2nd quarter. Races racing out toward the 3 quarter mile mark with the lead on the inside. Stormy Classic Juju Bean parked on the outside 2nd. No place to go for Fox Valley Allegra 3rd. Following cover Cullen all the way 4th. 5. No place to go. Obvious secret. Race Racing six, roam the country. Seven and trailing is called a fluke. They're at the three quarter. They're past that juncture and 128, top of the lane. Stormy Classic, who already has 11 wins tucked away, looking for 12 in the final eighth mile. From behind her, Fox Valley Allegra hunting room. Outside, Juju Bean dropping back. It's Stormy Classic. Stormy Classic storms the lane. Stormy Classic will win number 12. The battle is behind her and up to be second unofficially. Juju Bean finishing third was Fox Valley. Allegra four to obvious secret under the wire five roam the country six Cullen all the way seven is one color to she did not have the benefit of picking up wins and double dashes all but one of those tests came in single dash races so she has won probably nine or ten stakes owned by Kelsey Scott and by Judy Scott of Moorhaven Florida trained by Kelsey normally driven by Kelsey Scott but today with Bill Alanya at the lines, here's 12-time two-year-old winner Stormy Classic. <laughs> Winning Philly now receiving the blanket. Being presented by ISOBA director Brenda Watson. Bred by the owners Scott Philly by Cortland Classic from the out to win mare Vegley Bay. Her mother has been a very good producer. Not only does she have this exceptional filly, Vegley Bay has another 55 two year old to her credit, along with a couple of other two minute performers. She has one in 54, so big uh, performer now 56 for this filly from that good mare Vegley Bay. And now trackside to the winner's circle to Kurt and Bill. All right, thank you, Carl. Driver Bill Alanya down track side here. Bill, it looked like they threw everything at you but the kitchen sink on the last turn. Tell us what happened. Oh, this filly was just kind of on cruise control. She was doing it pretty smooth, and then when they all came at her in the last turn, I just asked her for a little speed, never had to hit her, just clucked her, and she was off and going. I want to ask you also about a race you drove in earlier today.
your own trotting filly, Margie Giggles, came from way off the pace to be third in the third race today. You've got her qualified for the $60,000 final this coming week. She raced huge, didn't she? Oh, I was real tickled with her. She's just, she's raced good all year. Well, you've had a good afternoon, Bill. We'll let you get back to work. Congratulations. All right. Thanks, Kurt. That's Bill Alanya, the winning driver. Back to Carl.